what's up my lady loves and welcome back to Pokemon Storm Silver version. In the last episode we took on uh, Rocket peoples in the Slowpoke well and in this episode we're going to be taking on the Azalea Town Gym. And we've got a new team member here, uh, our little Hoot Hoot buddy that we trained up on the off screen montage thingy thing that's not technically off screen because we did it on screen but hey hey don't don't say that don't say that guys let's go ahead and pick up some potions though before we take on this gym because it's gonna be a very very tough battle because it's bugs and man that guy was really close to my face it's kind of creepy uh, but I'm kind of worried about this gym just because of how hard it was in the original games and this is storm silver which is basically just an upgraded uh, difficulty from the older games but I'm also gonna be trying to fight every single trainer in this gym and I also have a few little explanations. I know I'm saying also and 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 all that stuff a lot, but yeah, I have an explanation. I was actually uh, really sick, like I said, in Light Platinum, and I wasn't actually able to upload and record. And the time that I was able to record, I was really scared. And the reason being is uh, I was really scared to jump back into this game because, as you can see, it's a very hard game and it's a Nuzlocke, and my first one, by the way. So, yeah, it's just kind of scary jumping right back into this game, but we ha I had to come back uh, sooner or later, so I'm glad to be back and I'm glad to finally be playing this game again. And we need to watch out for that bide. Actually, we're going to switch Pokemon here because uh, we don't really want to die. Let's actually go into Bejesus and go for a Dragon Rage. I feel like... Hopefully it has less than 40 HP. Yeah, it did. All right, that's, that's an all right call on us. And let's go ahead and go back and heal. Uh, I'm going to be healing a lot because this is a Nuzlocke and I don't want to lose any of my Pokemon. So uh, we're probably going to have to visit another route, though, on the right of us. I don't believe that we've caught our first Pokemon in uh, the route to the right of us. So we might actually do that right now because I actually want to level up my Pokemon uh, so we can evolve it this episode because I do want this guy to get to level 20 and I might actually start training up my Pokemon and actually evolving them in the montage. I know it's not ideal, uh, but it's kind of hard for me because you really, I, I know it's a Nuzlocke and some people have even said that I've over leveled my Pokemon, but uh, the thing is if you don't over level you lose. So it's kind of the point of the game is to, to not lose your Pokemon. So, I don't know. I'm sorry if you guys don't like the training montages, but the thing is I have to do them if I don't want to lose. So, yeah, if you want the series to keep going, then it's just what I have to do. And, oh my god, Mach Punch did a lot of damage. Uh, you know what? Let's go ahead and go into, I guess, Bejesus. Hopefully, Bejesus can do well against this guy. Uh, let's go ahead and go for the Dragon Rage. He has Ice Punch. Okay, that is, that's really scary. All right, and Ninkata, hopefully... This thing doesn't have any rock moves because I know it's like a ground type or whatever, but let's go ahead and go for the air cutter. Did good amount of damage and a Skaroopy. Uh, an air cutter hopefully should be enough to take this guy out. So here we go. Nope, not quite enough. One more. And there we go. Gaining some nice EXP from that. All right, well, let's head back and go ahead and heal up our Pokemon. But you know what? Let's actually go to uh, the route to the left so we can actually, or to the right rather, so we can catch a Pokemon and uh, just try to level up this hoot hoot one more level I don't want him to die and I don't really I really want to get him to a nocturne before or a nocturne is that his noctowl what's a nocturne I don't know what that is uh, but yeah I want to get him to a noctowl uh, before we actually fight the gym leader because I feel like it'll be much more useful in a gym fight so I don't think we've caught the Pokemon in this area so let's go ahead and look at our bag and check our Pokeballs. Alright, we've got a Fastball and two Lure Balls and eight Pokeballs. We should be fine to catch a Pokemon on this route. Uh, if we're going to catch the first Pokemon, I think I'm going to go on with Bejesus so we can paralyze it. If he has Thunder something, I don't remember if he does or not. Alright, first Pokemon is Slackoff. Uh, Vigoroth is pretty cool, so why not just catch this guy? I mean, hopefully you don't die to a Slam. Okay, you're good. One more Slam would be nice. No, don't Encore us. All right, well, let's go ahead and go for this Pokeball. Probably going to catch him first try. Uh, since his, he's lazy, um, I'm going to name this guy Shaggy. I don't know why. He just he looks really lazy. So we'll keep this guy in our storage, though, so we always have a Pokemon to fall back on. So now we're going to actually run around and not with this Pokemon, preferably. Ooh, a Swablu. That would have been pretty cool to run into first, but unfortunately, we got another normal-type Pokemon. Don't know how many we actually have, but it seems like we have a lot of normal type Pokemons. But now we're going to be training up uh, this this Jammy, Jamie. I don't really know what your name was. I don't know what I was going for. It's been a while since I played, and I kind of forget what the heck I'm doing <laughs> every time I pick up this game again. All right, a Slock Out. Uh, let's see if we can kill this thing with Uproar. I don't, I really don't know what to do against this guy. So here we go, Uproar. And that was pretty nice. I want to get this guy to level 19 because I'm pretty sure, okay, that is... 
That is a Rhyhorn. That would have been nice to catch. That would have been a great teammate. I mean, Rhydon would be amazing. Uh, but another slack off. Okay, this should easily get us up to level 19. So there we go. And we're level 19. Awesome. I think we evolve at level 20 or 22. I really hope it's not 22 because that would that would suck, actually. And I think it is 22. I, don't, I think I forgot about that. Really hope it's not, but whatever. Okay, let's go ahead and heal up our Pokemon and go back into the gym. I know that I'm taking a long time, but uh, it, it's better to take my time in Nuzlocke. I really don't want to lose, so I'm playing this really careful, or at least trying to. Uh, some of you argued that I wasn't really playing it careful when I lost, uh, what's that guy's name? Azar. Yeah, so it has been a while since I played this game, and I'm a little bit uncomfortable doing a Nuzlocke after not playing Pokemon for a very long time. Uh, but whatever, I, I'm confident in my abilities. We, we got this. I mean, there's a bunch of little kids, right? A bunch of little kids in shorts. But he, let's go ahead and pick up on this battle against this guy. A, a worm madam. A worm, a worm, a worm madam? Worm madam? How do I say that? I don't even know. You guys should tell me how to pronounce that name because I've never... Uh, I, I don't really know how to pronounce it. So stop protecting, please. And there you go. You are done. And that's a lot of EXP. I really hope we evolve next level. But let's go ahead and give this guy EXP share. I think we have one, right? We have EXP share. Yes, we do. Uh, why haven't we given this to you? All right, you take that, and let's go ahead and heal up some of our Pokemon, too, because, well, I guess it's just Jamie that we're going to heal. But, yeah, we don't want to be all damaged and beaten up when we face these two little girls, because everybody knows uh, little girls are the hardest trainers in the world. So let's go ahead and face them. That's double battle. I actually wanted to switch, but I it doesn't really matter. Okay, so someone told me that Volbeat is an uh, electric bug in this game, so I'm definitely going to be switching out into Patrick. And, uh, you know, I, I guess we can just stay in with this guy. But yeah, we definitely want to switch out because, see, there you go. It would have used Thunderbolt, which is really bad. So thanks for the tip, guys. That's a really nice tip of you to give me. So there we go. Get the Volbeat taken out. And Jamie is level up, level level 20? Level level 20. All right, there we go. I don't know what I'm saying. Uh, okay, let's go for a Water Pulse on this Dust Tox and go for the Dragon Rage on that guy. So, boom, GG Hater, fall to the floor or disappear. I can't really tell what they do. But, all right, all right, more Water Pulses. We're going to get these guys taken out. I really want to fight the Gym Leader in this episode, but I'm kind of scared as to what he's going to do. I feel like I should switch out Bejesus. He's getting a little bit low on health. Actually, you know what? Let's just heal him up. Hopefully, they have nothing uh, super effective against us. So, here we go. Okay, absorb. That's really bad. Uh, okay, let's go for a water pulse and then let's heal you up with a super potion. We don't want these guys to die. I really care about you guys. Yeah, we don't want you to die. Especially you, because you're our best Pokemon right now, Patrick. Actually, you're all really good, but... Okay, you're literally doing nothing. Let's go ahead and switch out into Muck, I guess. And now let's go for a Dragon Rage on this beautiful eye because Dustox is really low. Probably could have killed it, but whatever. There we go, get that guy taken out, and then boom, and boom. Alright, this should be it. Man, they're spamming a bunch of moves, but here we go. Confuse Ray, it doesn't really matter. Yes, it does, because he freaking confused us. Alright, that's bullcrap. There you go, get taken out. Finally, we're done. What? Jamie is evolving. Yes, okay, so I was right. It was level 20. I thought it was level 22 for whatever reason. But let's go ahead and speed that up. There we go, we got a knock towel. Nice, look at this thing fly behind us. Oh, you were beautiful. But we're going to go heal up our Pokemon before we take on this uh, dude, person, lady, man thing. I don't really know what he is, nor do I know what his gender is. But yeah, we'll, we'll figure this out. We'll figure this out. Let's go ahead and go heal up our Pokemon. Hopefully we can take this guy on in this episode. I'm pretty sure we're going to. I mean, their time's looking pretty good right now. And we got a Nocturne. I'm pretty... Noctowl. Why do I keep calling him Nocturne? What's a Nocturne? I'm trying to think. I don't... Lantern? Is that what I'm thinking of? I don't know. All right, well, let's go ahead and make our way back to the gym. You look so cool following us around. I really like you. Actually, is a beautiful Pokemon. Beautiful Pokemon. I keep kicking my mic. It's kind of uh, weird getting used to the setup again, and it's kind of weird getting used to uh, recording again, actually. It's kind of weird not being able to record for a very long time and then coming back and jumping right into it, but I hope you guys can uh, withstand the couple of awkward episodes if they are awkward for you guys, but... I, I don't really know. All right, well, let's go ahead and flip this red switch, and let's make our way up to the gym leader. Hey, gym leader Bugsy. All right, well, let's go ahead. I don't really know why I'm saving here, but uh, <laughs> it's kind of just force of habit, so that's my bad. Uh, come on, hurry up. I don't know I don't know why I saved. That's actually really bad. All right, well, uh, let's go ahead and try to fight this guy. I'm Bugsy. I will never lose when it comes to bug-type Pokemon. My research is going to make me the authority on bug-type Pokemon. 
Let me demonstrate what I've learned in my studies. All right, well, let's go. Let's take on Gym Leader Bugsy here. I literally have no idea what any of his Pokemon are. I do know for a fact that every single Gym Leader in this game has six Pokemon. So that's kind of scary. Uh, okay, doesn't look to be too challenging, though, because he has a very low-leveled Butterfree. So let's go ahead and uh, let's first go for... He's not going to be using physical attack, so Reflect would kind of be stupid in my opinion. So let's go ahead and go for that Air Slash. Rain Dance, I don't really know what that's going to do for you because you don't have any Water-type Pokemon, but hey, man, that's great. I think it's just going to... I think what he's trying to do here is actually get Fire-type uh, attack power to go down, which is actually a pretty good strategy. I should have should have thought about that, but okay, here we go. An Air Cutter, that's hopefully not going to do much against us. Yes, Jamie. Oh, God, what is happening? Uh, no. Okay, I don't know if you saw that, but something just glitched out. I'll probably cut that out or fade that out, but... Yeah, my screen just kind of flipped out, but here we go. We are level 21. Look at Jamie growing up on the levels. Good job. Okay, and the next Pokemon, I don't know who it's going to be. Okay, a Yanma. All right, that's pretty scary, actually. Uh, you know what? Let's go into John Boy here and just go for an Icy icy Wind. I think that's the move we have on it. John Boy's got this, so listen, let's listen to that beautiful cry. I think they made Glaceon, like, super overpowered in this game, though, because his stats are just amazing. Oh, we have Aurora Beam. All right, well, let's go ahead and go for the Aurora Beam. Detect. All right, you're protecting. You know what? I have a rule against that. Once you do that, then I get to super speed. So there you go. Get taken down. That Pokemon's gone, and John Boy getting some nice EXP from that. Actually, not really nice EXP, because I have EXP share on. That's not good. Okay, next Pokemon is Heracross. Uh, ooh, okay. Okay, uh, Jamie's got this. Jamie's got this. Four times super effective. Hopefully he doesn't have a Rock-type move. I have the feeling that they've given him a Rock-type move, and I don't know why I'm still continuing to use Jamie, but Jamie, I'm going to trust in you. Here we go. Go for the Air Cutter. Please, God, let it kill. Please, God, let it kill. Come on, I'm crossing my fingers. No, not quite. Oh, man, an Aerial Ace. Okay, that's not too threatening, really, so it's... I'm super speeding because he's going to use the healing item there and just take this guy out. All right, there we go. Third Pokemon down. And not as scary as I thought, actually. This guy's pretty darn easy. Actually, those two little girls that were outside of this place were a little bit harder. But don't tell him that. He might he might cry. We don't want that to happen. All right, so we're learning Confusion here. Let's go ahead and get rid of Uproar because I'd like to keep Reflect uh, just for a strategy and, and stuff like that. Strategiters. Okay, a Pincer. Uh, let's go ahead and stay in again. Sorry for the super speed. Uh, let's... Hmm... Confusion? Or... Let's go for the air cutter because that has stab. Alright, hopefully this air cutter can take this guy out in one hit. I highly doubt it can because it didn't take out Heracross, but hey, it'll do a big chunk of damage. So look at that. Vital throw. Okay, that's actually really scary and I'm hoping it doesn't kill me. Okay, not even close. Alright, well let's go for that air cutter. We should have probably healed there, but... Yeah, because we could have missed that and actually that would have been really bad. That was a dumb decision on my part, but hey, we got lucky. Very lucky. Actually, I'm so glad we didn't miss. All right, now his last Pokemon is going to be Slyther. Uh, let's go ahead and go back into... Let's go back into John Boy here. John Boy's got this, right, John Boy? Yeah, you got it. You got it, John Boy. I think an Icy Wind will be more than enough to take this guy out, so it's actually not his last Pokemon. Holy crap. I'm kind of nervous now. Okay, let's go for the Aurora Beam. Sword Stance. Oh, my God. Okay. Uh, hopefully, the Aurora Beam does a good amount of damage. Okay, please. Get a freeze hacks or something. Kill this guy in one hit. I'm begging you. I'm begging you. Okay, good job, John Boy. Whew, okay, Swords Dance. That's a scary Scyther. All right, good thing that guy's taken out. I believe his last Pokemon is like. Uh, Kakuna? Maybe? Beedrill? Does he have a Beedrill? I don't know. Beedrill! That was a good call. Okay, uh, let's go ahead and stay in and go for the Aurora Beam because we're pretty much assured the win here. Level 18 Beedrill? Nothing. Even though it's my last Pokemon, bugs are tough. No, they're really not tough, actually. You could just stomp them with your feet. Uh, so, not really threatening Pokemon at all. Kind of kind of easy, actually. A U-turn. Who are you U-turning to, buddy? You going, you're just going back in your hand? Is that what you're going to do? Hang in there just a little bit more. Yeah, just a little bit more and you're dead. So, good game, buddy. Good game. And we actually defeated the second gym, Leader Bugsy. I'm, I'm excited. I didn't think I'd get it past the first gym or get... Past it first, Jim. Whatever. Wow, amazing. You're an expert on Pokemon. My research isn't complete yet. Okay, you win. Take this badge. Uh, da, 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 da. Okay, we got the Hive badge, which is pretty great. I don't want to know the benefits of it, actually. I don't really want to talk to you at all, unless that's Sword Stance. It's not. Okay, I dislike you. I really dislike you now. 
I don't want, I don't want your number. I really don't. Okay, well, let's go ahead and flip the switch because I believe we can go back in one go if we do this. But yeah, let's go ahead and make it back to the Pokemon Center before we end off today's episode. Uh, it was a fun episode, actually. We did really well. I was surprised that we didn't lose anybody. I'm planning on getting rid of Slugma, though, because Slugma is just not really a good Pokemon. And look at Professor El Elm. Erm? Erm. <laughs> Elm trying to get some tail over here, man. You dirty old man. Okay, well, uh, let's actually take EXP share from Noctowl before we go, because it's going to bother me, and I'm going to forget about it before the next episode. So let's go ahead and take that away. Um... Jesus, we'll switch you out. We're actually probably going to do a little bit of off-screen training. Maybe, maybe not. I don't know. I, it really depends on how I feel. I'm trying to trying to situate this. Come on. We, we want to look nice for when we come back. And I believe what we want to do is that. No, I want to be in the center. Okay, so we got to go boom, boom, boom. There we go. Look at that. All right, guys. So thank you so much for watching this episode of Storm Silver. And thank you guys so much for sticking with me through this long absence. I'm really sorry. Hopefully it doesn't happen again. So thank you all for watching. I will see you guys in the next episode. Oh,